then I can tell you about games that my housemates ended up buying on my Switch. Nice. Which I don't have anymore. I I used their accounts. Yeah, they pay it from their own accounts. In case they get their own Switch, I don't want to rob them of their games. Fair anyway. Enough. Anyway, they ordered Overcooked 2. Overcooked. Overcooked. You guys heard about that? That doesn't sound familiar to me. Nope. Okay, it's one of those. Well, of course, it's a cooking game. And then you have. It's a multiplayer cooking game. Ah. Where it's really crazy. It's really difficult. Really complex. You're trying to make these dishes, but then you gotta, you know, you gotta cut things, you gotta put things in the oven, you gotta make sure they don't overheat, and you gotta coordinate things with other people. And when you play at four players, everyone just yells at each other, and we didn't have four people. So it sounds like the kind of game me and Random would be trying to kill each other at. Yes, it would be that kind of game. Hey, exactly. Hey, we'd be trying to kill each other in single player games too, you know? What do you mean? We're already doing that with TMS. <laughs> <laughs> That's why you brought that book. Because <laughs> I did. Oh, yeah, you gotta read that book now that Quadron's here. Oh, yeah, I also got other stories about the Nintendo Switch, such as Pro Controller and the Stick Drift. Oh, yeah, no. that's a whole other thing that happened. That was interesting. I at least got to play some Mario Party with some of, the college, some of my college friends. Oh, the Super Mario Party? Yeah. Yeah, I got to play that too. Managed to win somehow, like sometimes. It's Mario Party. There's always a somehow. <laughs> There's always, always a, a somehow. somehow. There's always a somehow. Read me, read me life. Okay. So, you hear stories about broken tour and all the drifting before on Nintendo Switch? Nope. So my. Pro Controller ended up in an incident where if I move the analog stick, the left analog stick, to the right, then the stick would drift towards the left. Like, the game would think that I'm moving left, even though I'm moving the stick right. That's bizarre. That is unique. That was, of course, not very good, because it makes it really difficult to play some games, like Smash Brothers, when you need to dash to the right, but they end up moving left. Nah, it's just you know, hard that. mode. <laughs> It's hard mode, but all the time. <laughs> <laughs> so, the good news is, I actually managed to fix it. Well, at first, okay, I actually had to take down the controller twice. The first time I took apart the controller, I saw pieces of hair around the analog sticks, took them out, put it back together, and then everything seemed to work. And then, but then it happened again? And then a week later, oh man, the same thing happened. And then I was, you know, browsing Reddit because a lot of other people seem to have this issue. And someone was saying something about there's these little contact points, or these little contact ball thingies that are inside the analog sticks, which you need to replace. So I bought them, I think they paid seven bucks on eBay. Get these little pieces, little metal pieces that's around the analog sticks, took them out, and made Replaced the part, and I definitely saw some wear in the contact point, and then things worked again. So now you've got some DIY fixing experience. Yes, with a pro controller. Well, I also have another pro controller as well, because when that happened, I didn't have this, the tools to fix it, so we coordinated and agreed to just buy another controller, so now I had two broken controllers. Which is good because we had, before, first I only had two joy cons and one broken controller, and there happens to be four people in the house. Just me, my two housemates, and one of my housemates, his girlfriend, was there. So, that was good. Hey yo, fuck him up! Uh, <laughs> no, he was a goner. You, you wanna hear some, some silly that happened at my college? Go on. Uh, I already told Random this story, but you haven't heard it. So, my, there's my friend. He's conspiring to buy my senior project teacher an anime body pillow. I wonder why you want to buy that. But hey. Uh, <laughs> why would you want to buy that? <laughs> so like for so that he like he even tells the teacher he is going to get you like I am going to get you a body pillow. 
And like my teacher says, I don't believe you. I don't think you're gonna do it. Okay. Because it's because there's a fifty dollar limit for. I mean, there's that. So my friend and two of his friends wait for a sale. Uh -oh. They buy themselves one body pill and then get a fourth one for free. So they managed to skirt around that. They managed to skirt around that one. And uh, so on the day I do my senior project presentation. Okay. And this is also the day he's doing his presentation. He brings in, you know, two boxes. One of them being the stuff that has a Dreamcast stuff, because he's doing Dreamcast things. Dreamcast stuff? And, oh, okay. And there's this giant box that has the body pillow in it. <laughs> and the teacher doesn't know. <laughs> and, like, he also brought some of his friends, some of my college friends, all friends also come in to watch the reaction. So after he does his, after my friend does his presentation, the teacher decides, all right, let's just open this and get it over with. It was certainly a reaction. <laughs> with, I'm pretty sure a genuine, I can't believe you've done this. I can't believe you've done this. I can't believe it. Like, he even face plants the box at some point. Okay. It wasn't a violent face plant, it was just like, like that kind of face plant. Nice. That's like an event. Sounds like something. And like Definitely something. Like we had to take a break afterwards because he just needed to. <laughs> he had to process the fact that he was just that he has been given an anime lewd body pillow. Anime lewd body. Yeah, it's it's also one of the lewd body pillows. Maybe I'm not really aware about body pillows. It it was magical. It, it was certainly very magical. Magical experience. Please don't tell me. It's probably not something you would... Probably not something I would have seen. Not something you would experience ever, <laughs> but uh... It's something I get to experience, I guess. It's one of them once-in-a-lifetime opportunities. You might be wondering how I managed to stay alive even when my HP had been slowly decreasing. Um, it's called you're using that weapon. Yep. Give me your life! Was he sure? Yeah, that was my end of college experience. Me? It was, it was anime, lewd anime body pillows. I'll try not to visualize it. <laughs> how about that? <laughs> Go see Kuroi, I'll probably end up well. Yeah, you uh, will. <laughs> of course you will. You're the one who recommended we play TMS. I did. With the uncensored stuff. Yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah you're the one to blame for this. I don't, I don't even know what was censored and what wasn't censored, because everything was terrible. <laughs> I don't think I don't think censored. Man, that was just like Look, I didn't know better about games three years ago, okay? Oops. When I play that game. Now I understand. There's there's better RPGs out there. <laughs> there's better games out there. <laughs> yes. But there's better there's better simulators out there. And there's better there's definitely there's better, better idols out there. <laughs> oh fuck! You gone down day! Okay, I didn't kill all of them. Oh shit. Got that thousand yards there! Shoot him! Ooh, thank you. Like I'm gonna dance around my turret so that everything can get shot. Oh, I got my, lox my maxi life. Hell yeah. Fuck him up. Oh yeah, I didn't tell you about the other games, mate. One of my houses in the finals. Christ, did, you, did all you do at yeah. college just play games? Nope, we didn't we did more than that. I'm just bringing this up. Uh, copy that. Uh -huh. So what, what other game did your friends buy? Cuphead. Ah, okay. I guess I've definitely heard about that. I mean, I I'm I, I already know much about Cuphead because I've actually watched someone play through it. Yeah, we'll probably never play through it because we probably just, not. Because honestly, we we get bored of it. It's not for anything. Not we're not for any other reasons than we just get bored. It's fun to look at. I will say that. That's why I mean. Watch no, maybe. Yeah, I, it's not something I would really play though. I enjoy the music. Eh, the music's the same as all the other music. 
You can you can find the music in a ton of places. Don't don't sweat it too much. What yeah, no, it's, it's not really a game we would let's play <laughs> or stream because uh, it's kind of overplayed at this point. <laughs> that above all else. I mean, the same thing also applies to Cave Story. Mm -hmm. Uh oh, not that button. <laughs> and you guys used to play Cave Story. Yeah. You guys used to yeah, it, yeah. It's still on my Steam account. I mean, I, 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 I overplayed Cave Story to the point where I, did, where I, I redid my. Uh, Polar Star only run, and this time, and, and that time, I forgot. I literally forgot to get the uh, uh, the upgraded power okay. Polar no, Star. No, the guard. The guard. Oh. It, it's a Polar Star only, so I can't. So I can't even get the uh, what do you call it? The good gun. I can't. Uh -huh. I didn't even get that. But so it was. It was Polar Star only without the without the without the experience guard. So if you, so if I took five if I took five damage my gun would down. So you pretty much had to do everything perfectly. Yeah, I, I was it was great because I got because I got to the final I got to the final point and my and my gun was downgraded all the way to one. So I was so I was hitting the boss with one damage bullets over and over and over and over again. But you eventually succeeded. No, I got to like the final tenth the tenth of health down from like fifty percent. And then you died. And then I got and then I got lasered. Oh, <laughs> I got, oh you got I got super lasered. <laughs> you got lasered. It was great. I was so mad, and then I beat it without taking a hit. <laughs> And then you beat it. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see. Eh, maybe that's what random talks will be in the future. It's just games that we wouldn't let's play otherwise. Honestly, though. No. <laughs> like, that would be the one time Honestly, we have Cave like, Story. <laughs> no, it has to be decently enough. It has to be decently boring enough. Hmm. Alright, I'm gonna pass on that, because that looks like a whole bunch of that looks like a whole bunch of doodads, and I'm just gonna buy a rocket launcher. <laughs> Alright. So yeah. So how about so how about actual school stuff? Actual school stuff? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. I can tell. I can tell you about one of the classes that I took. Mm -hmm. I took a class that basically teaches grammar. Grammar. English grammar. English. Hmm. Not like computer grammar. That, that's that was my first thought. Yeah, because we're we're sciencey we're sciencey stupid. So we're, we're both doing engineering. There, there's a grammar class for engineering. There's an introduction to grammars, which yeah. I think is parsing and stuff. Oh fuck! I forgot to refresh. Double good syntax. Refuel my I, my ammo. Fuck. F, I wasted like two bucks. That was... That was a weird class. <laughs> oh, fuck me. It took me a while to think about good stories. About what happened in my classes. I mean, it's I not, don't have that many... Remarkable. I don't have that many good stories, to be honest. I think Random is the only one who really gets crazy stories. Because I do, I do crazy things and I enjoy classes usually. I mean, I enjoy the classes too. It's just. I mean, I do no, as well. It's nothing just... really crazy oh, happens. Fuck. Um, that looks like fun. I mean, I could tell you that the last quarter I uh, tried a class and then I decided, okay, this is gonna be one class where I'm gonna do an experiment. I never go to lecture. Why would you experiment that? <laughs> I'm Besides just... hating the class. Because I never did it before. I mean, I, I went there the first day. You, you just like really said... wanted to be a, <laughs> You just really wanted to be that guy, so you just, just skip class. Yeah, and it's like, hey, all my lectures are getting recorded online. And it's like, oh, I think I know what I'm going to try doing. I never did, did it, this before. Did it work it's... out? Oh, man. Well, he said, be careful, if you don't go to class, you're just going to be procrastinating, and then you're going to watch all my lectures, day before the exam. And that's exactly what I did. <laughs> did it work? No. Uh, no, well, 
<laughs> Did you get a passing grade? Got a passing grade. Is this a grade that I would, you know, be happy with? Maybe not. But did I pass? Yes, I passed. That's all that matters. In the last quarter. That's all that yeah. matters. Yeah. Uh, I don't. I don't, I don't really get. I because like when I because I have I have to take an extra quarter to get some to get back some of the credit. So mm -hmm. I also had so I also had like a whole bunch of people who were like, "Yo, we're not doing anything because this is our last quarter, biatch." And I'm like. I don't know. I did, I did. I I put a lot of effort because I because I wanted to do the projects. So because I really wanted to do the projects. I feel stupid for saying that, but that's the honest and goodness you truth. Want I mean, to do the like, projects? I like the project. The projects were fun. The projects were a lot of fun. Like stuff like senior project was honestly pretty fun. Like having to create something yourself on your own is pretty neat. Yep. Hard work is very fun. Which will, if I can, if you don't mind. What kind of DD you make for this in your project? What's uh, kind of thing? It's in that box. It's basically a custom DDR pad. And for me, a I... custom DDR. It's half scale, but it works. And well, that's something we'll get after this. I <laughs> now, now I'm intrigued. <laughs> and I did a uh, distributed system Pax Paxus blockchain. I think one of those boxes even has the actual control system. I hit the camera, but it doesn't matter. Throw that in there. Yeah, I think this is where the main board is. Yep. What the? So there's That's the a... main system. Mm -hmm. That's what controls everything. Then there's the amplifier circuits for the load cell sensors. Right. And then you gotta put it into the pad. The pad is inside. Yeah, the pad's okay. in there, but that's what all these wires connect to. Uh, and there's LEDs in there too. It's even multicolored. One, because I haven't actually seen you play DDR or Step Mania with I mean, an actual I'm, pad. I'm not playing it with that. That thing is Should. too small. <laughs> that thing is it too, is too literally too. half scale. Half scale is not the best. Okay, so here is the first titanium bolt of this series of planets. Well, like, it works. As a proof of concept, it works. So you remember the small plants from when you played from the one small plant from when you played uh, Ratchet Two? Uh, a little bit. Right. So here is a series. So now here's a series of small plants where the map is like this. It seems terrible. Yep. And here is the first titanium bolt. Hopefully, I'll burn my ass to get this first titanium bolt. Damn you! Oopsie. Hell yeah! And that was it. <laughs> Does it close after some time? Yeah, that's the whole the whole point is you're supposed to find there's a dy random dynamo hey, thing over there and you have to find where the, the gate is and it's used to a platinum bolt. But when you find it, you find it and that's it. And it's literally just a straight path to it too. It was not clever at all. But anyway, for some reason you're supposed to uh for some reason, on this planet, you're supposed to connect the satellites together to go to the next place, and I really do not know why. But there's also a skill point, a really crazy skill point in this mission, in this point, on this section actually. It's really dumb. I'll show it to you soon enough, I guess. Is this it? Oh, this is definitely it. Okay. You just gotta wait for the right out coloration of the meteor asteroids. So this is an asteroid belt. It's literally a straight line. <laughs> Would you imagine? Can you imagine that? Okay, we're gonna be waiting here for a bit, so you guys keep talking. <laughs> I just remembered another story. Mm -hmm. That's actually no squirrely. So. How do you feel about when you go inside a, a lecture hall class, mm -hmm. you take a seat, and the other person says, Hey, I have a friend that's going to sit here. And then you that's say, really too weird. bad. That's what you do. Oh, mm. fuck. Mm. Oh, the fuck. Oh, all the fucks. Okay, well, well, in one of my classes, I kind of got fed up with the situation. Okay? This one person is saying, hey, I sat in a seat and said, Hey, I have a friend who's gonna sit here. Okay, so I 
I decided to respect it the first time, and then turns out that friend never showed up to class. Ah. And there we go. For the entire 50 minutes of that class, there was one empty, very, very good seat. It was pretty close to the, to the front. Taken. Well, go quote unquote taken from a friend who just prefers to not go to class for some reason. Naturally, I was not really happy with this. Alright, we got the skill point. Yes. Nice. For some reason, there's Ex just a couple yes. asteroids that they decided to give flat toss to, and the whole skill point is you landing uh -huh. on them. So they made it shine a little bit. Yes. It was, it's a kind of really stupid, but you know, part for the course of this uh. game. But yeah, anyway, I just couldn't see it any longer, and I did what I normally wouldn't do. I actually confronted the guy. Why though? It's kind of rude. A little rude. Yeah, it was a little rude. I will admit, but I mean, why take good seats from people who don't show up to class anyway? And that's kind of what I said to him. I, I said, I don't know how I feel about this. He didn't say anything. And then next day, not where I saw that he was letting other people take the seat next to him. It's like, huh. Did he do something that happened to have worked? He's pimping himself that. out. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. What's the next satellite? That's the old satellite. Come in here. The old satellite, as opposed yes. to the new age satellite. So yeah, <laughs> I don't know how much of the stories I can, I can repeat because I honestly forgot some of them. <laughs> <laughs> eh, they're probably on older videos, right? Yeah, they're on the videos. I can, I, if, if I hear them, I, I'll definitely, oh yeah, that happened. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll get to upload them at some point. I think they're already uploaded, either way. There's that, there's, people are starting to comment on the videos illegitimately. Yeah, no, I don't know why. I went the wrong way, excuse me. Yes, you did. I'm gonna burst some meteors out of this moment. It wasn't under the laser beam. I'll fix that right away, sir. Because you're supposed to use laser to get rid of this field of no good, no no's. Oh, okay. No no happy time. So I'm just gonna jump the other direction and miss. Exactly. And... Almost fall into the lava. Hey, I already done that too many times. I mix it up a couple of times. You know what I'm saying? What if I don't know what you're saying? Fuck you! Why did we have to do this? Who the fuck knows? So now we now we go to planet two on this planet? Question mark. Oh, I missed. Oh, come on. Can you even break anything? Oh. You poor f metallic flowers. Oh, hi. I did not know this you were there. Oh, is that the disc gun? It is the disc gun. F. You need to murder more things, don't you? Mm-hmm. Okay, those aren't not- those can't even be- those don't even look like mushrooms, alright? <laughs> like, these look like mushrooms! I believe there's a skill point for destroying a couple satellites, but I can't remember. What was that? Oh fuck! Ooh. Oh my god, these guys take so much damage. V4! For some reason they made the platform with the absolute worst gun weapon in the game. 
Oh yeah, do you guys have any conflicts in your house? Macy had to resolve. Not really, right. no. Um, the whole point of having, I, I've I, pretty I, much had single rooms for like the past couple turns. Uh, yeah, I've been, yeah, I've been, I have like double rooms with like, uh, with me and another person. What the fuck is that crate doing there? And we usually, and we're all, all, usually on the sides of the rooms that don't talk to each other. Uh, there was, I had, there was some drama last year because all my roommates are friends with each other. Because the thing about the thing about uh, roommate drama is that the drama usually happens between people who who are friends. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it usually happens between people who are who are friends and decide to room with each other because you because people assume when you room with them, oh we know everything about each other, but it turns out oh we did not know everything about each other. Oh that that was a mistake. And then some drama happens, and you have to, and like some guy forgot to get the toilet paper or something, or all <laughs> the toilet paper is gone. It's usually always a toilet paper too, for some reason. 